Okay, so maybe VD3 isn't so free. How's it going, Big Bear XD XBA? Hey, Newster, how's it going? SMW Rando randomizes movement speeds of enemies. No, I don't believe it does. The pointer to a given entity is definitely different than changing that entity's behavior. If you were to change the movement speed of, just to give an example, a yellow flying Koopa Troopa, that would change it globally. Every instance would have that new value. Bart House went poorly. I'm sorry to hear that, Faisu. So yeah, while doing something like that would be possible, um, It would be a fairly challenging um, fairly challenging setting just at the best of times and probably would need to be subject to a ton of, uh, of QA. I'm not familiar enough with the way that entity behavior is coded to know how much ASM it would be. Um, a naive implementation probably wouldn't take all that much assembly. It would take some for sure, but probably not too terribly much. One that was actually robust would probably take a decent amount. I hate that I keep on locking in at instant 51 speed while I'm bad at this game. As soon as I'm de-rusted, it's going to be instant 40, uh, 47 speed forever.
terrible. Two fifty. Uh, no, forty seven speed is in fact a smaller number. When people talk about flight speed, they're going to use a number typically between 47 and 51. Uh, that is the number of subpixels per frame that you're moving. Like right now, I'm moving. It's probably 47, actually. Yeah, ideally you want 51, which is why it's kind of sad that I'm getting 51 right now while I'm bad at this game. As opposed to theoretically in the future when I am marginally less bad at this game. Oh, that's good. That's, that's definitely how you want this to go. So if you look at static entities like that Yoshi coin that just went by, um, the way the amount and the manner of movement that they uh, exhibit on the screen is how you can tell what speed you're moving at. Due to the fact that you're you're actually moving at fractional pixels per frame every so often it has to uh like right now i'm moving at 48 which is the only one that's evenly divisible which is why it's smooth now i'm moving at this looks like probably 50. basically the way that things jitter is how you tell what your speed is Yo, Dawson Paler, how's it going? Run's not too bad so far. We're still in warm-up territory. Realistically, we're going to be in warm-up territory until uh, about 22, 2300 tonight, at which point I'll cut stream. No, although I do know a lot of people who uh, write Rust and who would like to Rust more, not de-Rust. my controller and I was just very 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 reminded of that fact oh well.
that as a backup. Just feel real angry right now. That's what we're gonna do. Terrible run. Well, VD3 is going to be where we reset anyway, so that's fine. Faizu! Faizu, why would you not be recording? Faizu, Iron G and Bart Pig not recording the new Bart House world record. Excuse me, I'm sorry, uh, Faisu. Iron GM, no, I'm not going to be Iron GM, Bart Pig, don't you dare write that down. Not recording the new world record for Bart House. I think it's just Iron GM, Bart Pig for short though, right? Thank you for the 100 bits, uh, Super Mike. I'm so angry that that was a gold. I mean, I reset my golds, which is why that was a gold, but I'm still very, very angry.
But yeah, just a reminder for anybody who's new. All the money from this stream, from the cheers, from subs, everything. Um, all goes to the, uh, the Extra Life charity drive that's linked in my stream info. So thank you again, Mike, for making me feel real good about what I'm doing. Which says something, because I'm doing really poorly. But on top of that, you're helping sick kids, and that's pretty fucking cool. Super Mike, this is a hell game. Why did I come back to this? Why did I let them talk me into joining a tournament to play this game? The Zampo, huge fan lurker here. Good luck on the runs. Well, thank you very much. I'm really glad that you enjoy the stream. And thank you for the good luck. I'm real bad at this game. I was never good at this game, but right now I'm extra bad, which is, uh, I think, entertaining for the people who are watching. Ooh. Turns out I can do still do flight at 51 speed in this room. That's good. Panzer Dave, that's incredibly kind of you. I should pick up Chubby Cherub instead. I'm not so sure about that. I mean, Eon, you play some good games, like Biomiracle, Boca Te Upa, but you also play Pyramid. Yo, half coordinated. Thank you very much for the good luck with the bad game. I appreciate it. Also, in case it's not obvious, I'm just running against some of best. That's not good. Improvising the levels that you're doing is not fun. It's not something that you should do. Most of these levels have like, really good strats that, if you just do them correctly, you can go fast. <laughs> Going fast sounds fake. Yeah, pretty much. Might have been a corner boost. I'm not sure. That was either a corner boost or it held me back and I'm not sure which it was. Garrett, there is a global flame, uh, frame counter that ultimately decides whether or not you get that um, clip. It's also possible to get what's called clean clip, where you don't ever get stuck in the terrain. And, um... 
that can be problematic. Not because it's dangerous at all, but most people try to dismount and remount to clip into the terrain as quickly as possible. And due to that, um, Anyway, due to that, um, you can, uh, you can clip straight through and then lose Yoshi because you dismounted at a bad time. That's not good. There we go. That please. Yeah, it happens. This was a mediocre run before. I guess I need to practice Roy. Almost, almost managed to go for um, Panga Strap. suck at this game, it turns out. Who knew? Pixel Pepper. Did I know that you're a castle? I did not. <laughs> Dawson Taylor. I'm just trying to, to get some lava facts out of Dawson Taylor for the chat. Well, it's true, you are. Congratulations on what I assume is your newfound castlehood. Just gotta do it that way every time. Oh boy. How's it going, Ian Holwood? So, fun fact, there's a pipe hidden above, there it is. A little bit too early, it's fine. A Bootu. One year. Thank you so much for a year-long subscription. It's incredibly kind of you.
Alright. It's not gonna be a PB, but if I can finish this, like, without any more major screw-ups, I'm gonna put this up on YouTube so that I can be a content producer. Oh. Drex is now hosting. Drex, thank you very much. Hope you're doing well. Uh, thanks. Dawson Taylor is now hosting me. Thank you, Dawson Taylor. GDQX games list depression. Yeah, I hear you. I know a lot of people are suffering from that lately. I am sorry to hear it. I feel like uh, Drex already has the first part of that town. Drex could submit Pugsy to PBG. Also, anybody who doesn't already know... I guess we're doing this one slow. Anyway, as I was saying, anybody who doesn't already know Big Bad Gameathon, uh, you should. Maybe somebody can link Big Bad Gameathon in chat. Um, but you should also be following Brosincha just in general, because if you if you followed Brosincha, you would know Big Bad Gameathon. Okay, that's great. What a scrub tier speedrun this is. Yeah, I hate to tell you this, Drex, but while Pugsy is a genuinely fun game, um, I have the box somewhere around here. But while, while Pugsy is a genuinely fun game, um, it's not a good game. It definitely does, it, it belongs in Big Bad game of fun Oh, you threw Arquista's ring in. Oh, that's awesome. Real sad that we're four minutes and 22 seconds below my sum of best now. Also, actually, me having purchased Pugsy is not a vote in its favor. Thank you. 
Oh yeah, it's more. Bad movement. Double time. Adam Mathis, yeah. Yeah, seeing normal level design after playing a ton of Kaizo definitely is weird. I had to get used to it when, um... Because I, I played through Kaizo on stream before I, uh... Okay, cool. But yeah, I, I beat uh, Kaizo 1 on stream before I started running Mario World. So it was... Uh... Something to get used to, for sure. Oh my god, please. Yeah, I love the door fly dive. It looks so scary. It's not as scary as it looks. Okay, but that is. Drex, thank you for dropping by. Thank you again for the host. Blurial, how's it going?
Might be too late. I might lose my cape here. Or I might get an insta hit. Might be too early. I might lose my cape here. Or I might get an insta hit. Cool. Well, that was a fun series of heart attacks. Maybe, what, plus two minutes, I guess, on my PB? Not bad for D Rust. Blurial. worst ever. Thank you for the GG's, everyone. Well, this is my first completed run since I came back to this game, so I guess I'll let this play out so I can upload it to YouTube. Um, and then we'll do some more. There's a few points in this run that I feel like I probably could have... probably could have... Um, done better. Don't know. Maybe. Who's to say? Dairyberry, thank you for the GG. How's it going? No golds, so it's impossible to know. Yeah, I killed all my gold splits because I've changed where I'm splitting. Uh, probably won't upload it until after the stream, though. That would be unwise. I probably have the upstream to do it, but um, OBS limits my, my upstream usage to a number that I set and youtube.com slash upload does not. Super Mike, thank you for another 100 bits. That is super kind of you. Thank you for the good luck. I hope that you uh, that you have a good stream yourself.
Hi guys, how's it going? I'm looking for a BRB chip. Uh, specifically one from the SMB Super Show, and boy is it hard to find an actual downloadable GIF of it. Lots of web peas, which are a tremendous pain to uh, to embed. Have I played any Octopath? Gosh, yes, I have. Uh, it's real good. There's like 20 hours of raw footage up on YouTube. Um, I haven't done any like commentary or anything like that. It's not anything that I've been streaming. But uh, if you want to watch me get a bunch of game overs because I'm underleveled, YouTube is the place to find it. <laughs> 